I found these glasses in my room and they remind me of summer and I really miss summer so I'm just wearing them right now. <sighs> Hello my beauties, how are you guys doing? I'm doing fantastical, fantastical, yeah that's cool. I'm sorry about my hair and also my naked face, but today's video is my skincare routine video. Isn't that super duper exciting? Yay! I don't know how like great I look right now. Do I look okay? Is everything on point? Basically all I did today or my eyebrows, just a little bit on the ends, and my eyelashes. So everything else is completely natural. Oh, I also put on lip balm. Sorry about that. So I'm gonna walk you through my daily skincare routine thing. And as you probably remember from my other videos, I've had a lot of problems with my skin and it's not been good. So, I want to show you what has gotten me through this terrible time and what has worked for my skin and will possibly work for yours. Let's jump into it. My skincare routine is very simple. <laughs> very simple. I totally sounded like Tyler Oakley just then. I'm gonna start with my night routine. My first product during the night is to like take off all my makeup and to cleanse my face are these Nutri- well, compared to Neutrogena because they're Target brand. Neutrogena oil-free cleansing wipes in pink grapefruit and they're for acne-prone skin and they help so much. You just rub them all over your face, it takes off all the makeup, all the dirt from that day, and it fights against acne, so that's really awesome. And they come in count of 25 and I found that the Up and Up towelettes are perfectly just as good as the Neutrogena ones. But I like these and they're not that expensive so I used up one bag and I got two more bags and I love them. So this is what I use at night because my skin is dry and oily and I find that if I wash it at night um, with whatever kind of wash it gets weird and flaky and uncontrollable. So these puppies have saved my life because I don't actually need to wash my face at night. After I do that at night, I use my Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel. And this is amazing. I think it's like 15 bucks, which is kind of more expensive, but this bottle has lasted me for I think like a year or two, maybe a year. It says to apply twice daily, which is what I do. I apply two pumps, two to three pumps, depending on you know, how much moisture I need after I wipe my face down with the cleansing towelettes. And I also do it in the morning, which I will show you when we get to the morning section of this. But it's so nice. I really like it. It's very moisturizing. And it's also kind of cooling when you put it on. So I recommend this if you have the cash money to do it. Otherwise, I find something similar. So like a different gel moisturizing thing. Um, at a drugstore brand. Then after that for my night care routine, I focus on my spots, which are these regions. And I use the Body Shop Tea Tree Spot Treatment Oil. This stuff is fabulous. I'm afraid I'm gonna run out again. It's once again more expensive, it's $9, but it's so amazing. You just use a Q-tip and you like, it's got this little, here, let me open it for you. It's got a little plug that you just like, then dip it onto the Q-tip and then you just like put it on all your spots or all of the places that you could get spots and it clears it up so nicely without drying stuff out. And it smells like, kind of like pine trees. It's strong smell, but you get used to it and it is amazing. So I definitely recommend that. <clears throat> Now on to my morning skincare routine. I don't know what this movement is. It's also extremely simple. There is only two things that I use in the morning and you can't judge because the first one is pretty weird. It's honey. No judgments. I read on a blog a while ago, a couple blogs, and a good face, face wash in the morning to restore moisture is apparently like pure natural honey. So I got this from Myers. It's pure clover honey and it works. I do have to say it basically what you do is you wet your face down a little bit and have with warm water and have like the tips of your fingers wet. And then you put on like a 
glob of it onto your fingers and you rub it in here a little bit and then I just like streak it here and here and then like let it sit as I put things away and let the water warm up more and then you just wash it off. Don't rub it in because I've found that that does weird things but if you just kind of use it as like a very quick temporary face mask in the morning and then you just wash it off with lukewarm water it's incredible so pure honey if you want to try it it's great for restoring moisture and I guess like making skin more radiant and also like uh, 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 helping with acne I, I don't quite remember but yeah I recommend that because that has helped me I don't know if it's gonna help anyone else and then in the morning once again I use my Clinique dramatically moisturizing gel thing and it helps a lot and I love it so much so yeah that happened I keep rolling around in my chair Whee! I just want to let you know that my skin was terrible before I started doing this like I mean it wasn't it hasn't always been but for some reason this winter just went really intense on it and I was getting a lot of acne I think from stress from school and like life and then it just went dry and oily and it was totally weird it just I never like experienced anything like it before so then I was messing around with so many things and so many products and just nothing was working until I found this weird little throw together odd mix of products and things. Materials? Foods? Honey? So, it's odd, it's weird, but it works for me. And if you guys want to try it, um, or just try any individual products in here with your normal skincare routine. Let me know what you think, give this video a thumbs up if you like it. I guess links to products will be down below. Peace, love, and baby ducks, and I will see See you all next week. Bye. The week. Wee. Oh my god, I'm so disgusting. Clinique Uh. Oh.